Hi folks, George Davis with Stone Brothers and Bird. You know, it's, uh, it's mid late June now uh, in North Carolina and our gardens are producing and our early stuff that we planted uh, late March, early April is, is beginning to, uh, to produce and come in. So we're beginning to think about uh, late gardening. And I wanted to bring a little uh, tip to you today on, uh, on tomatoes. And, uh, you know, early in the spring, we, we come in and we buy our nice little tender uh, tomato transplants, and they're great. The weather's still a little cool, and, and they get started, and they grow with the summer heat. But we'd like to put in late tomatoes, and this time of the year, a lot of times, we find in this size plants, which really is advantageous because this is a nice... Uh, healthy stocky plant and I want to show you how to, to deal with a plant like this. Most people don't realize that tomatoes are tropical plants and a tropical plant or especially a tomato plant anything over six inches in the ground will rot on a tomato. Well we're interested in this hot hot sun uh, to plant uh, late tomatoes but we certainly can't uh, can't afford to lose them so this is what we do. We take and we strip all the little offshoots off of the, the, the stem and we just leave a top notch and then we take and we we dig a, our, our uh, furrow on a 45 degree angle like so if this is our soil surface and not letting more than six inches of the root ball be below the ground we plant them on a 45 the sun will draw the tomato up and then all these little feeder roots or spider roots we call them will emerge on this stem under the soil, will help anchor the plant and get you through this hot weather and it will just take off and it will never stop. This is one of the best times of the whole year to trench tomatoes and trenching is what we call this. Another little helpful tip from, tip from Stone Brothers and Bird.